my agent thought it it would sell and was surprised when it was turned down everywhere. The only thing that that kept me from, uh, you know, really really getting down about it, although I, I was getting I was getting married at that time while I was getting turned down, and I remember and my wife's family lives in Australia, so we were there getting ready for the wedding, and it was just. Every day there were, you know, five more rejections, and and uh, it, it sort of didn't look good for, uh, you know, and I sort of I felt awful for for my wife for you know marrying a guy who was getting <laughs> getting rejected every day, you know, turned out to be thirty five or whatever it was, but uh, um, but around somewhere in there, somebody in the UK published it, and through Flamingo, which no longer exists, but was a great. A great imprint. I'd never been to England, but I just had this thought: there's this guy over there who who likes the book, and he's going to publish it. And that's that definitely lifted my spirits and and kept me from really getting too down about it. And I just thought, well, eventually it'll it'll come around, and it did.